हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम तुषार डकाल वेलकम टू माय चैनल इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट एच टी एम एल हाई पर टेक्स्ट मार्क ऑफ लैंग्वेज इफ यू हैव नॉट सब्सक्राइब द चैनल प्लीज डू नॉट फॉरगेट टू सब्सक्राइब इफ यू सब्सक्राइब द चैनल वट एवर द वीडियोज आई अपलोड यू विल गेट द नोटिफिकेशन सो डू नॉट फॉरगेट टू सब्सक्राइब द चैनल टू गेट द न्यूज वीडियोज HTML. HTML stands for Hypertext Markov Language. Full form is Hypertext Markov Language. The full form of HTML is Hypertext Markov Language. HTML. It is not the programming language, but it is a Markov language. A Markov language is a set of Markov tag. So HTML uses Markov tags to describe web pages, and HTML was developed by Tim Berners-Lee. Developed by Tim Berners-Lee at Schon. The European Particle Physics. Laboratory in Geneva, Switzerland. It was developed in nineteen eighty nine. In some book, it is written nineteen ninety. But it was developed by Tim Berner Lee. But in nineteen ninety four, W three C. W three C means World Wide. Web Consortium, World Wide Web Consortium. This controls the. Uh, this was formed, and this is the body which controls the HTML standards at present. Means this W three C, it controls the HTML standards. At present, HTML tag HTML tag contains three parts. That is identification of tag, identification, identification of tag, attribute, and value. This will read when I write the text. At that time, I will teach you about this. And HTML tag is tag has two sections. It is divided into two sections. One is head section, and next is head. With title, a uh, title, and in with title, and then after in with head. So head enclose title. A uh, title is between the head tag, and the next is the body tag. This body tag recognize the beginning and ending of the body. So HTML section is divided into two parts. One is heading, head part, and the next is body part. Like that, the HTML. There are two types of HTML tag. There are two types of HTML tag. That is pure tag and singular tag. Pure tag. Pair tag and singular tag. There are two types of tag. Pair tag, which has the starting tag, beginning of the tag, and ending the tag. They are known as the pair tag. Which tag has beginning tag as well as the ending tag. The next is singular tag, which is also called the empty tag. This. Has the beginning, but not the ending tag. For example, 
br break line for break line we use br tag like that hr tag for horizontal row as well as img tag for image these are the singular tag or which are also called the empty tag the pr tag body itself is a pr tag head is a pr tag paragraph is a pr tag dot 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 which is body we have to close the body closing head we have to close the head like that we have to close the P for paragraph tag. These are known as the PR tag. There are many PR tags used in HTML. As well as there are some headings that are used in HTML. Head one two, head six. So big and bold heading helps to make our web pages. Our web documents attractive. HTML allows us six level of heading, and each level has predefined function and its font size. So the biggest one, heading one, whatever we write here, the heading one, it is the biggest one, and heading six, it is the smallest one among the headings. Heading two is less smaller than heading 1 and s3 some text s3 heading 4 some text heading 4 heading 5 some text heading 5 and heading 6 there are six headings used in html tag and which has their predefined fonts as well as the font size Heading one is the biggest, and heading six is the smallest one. Now, let's write the HTML tag. HTML tag to write three by three table. How to write the HTML tag to draw three by three table? Now, let's start. with the html html tag is not case sensitive that's why you can write in small letter as well as the capital letter and start with html tag and in with html there are pro head section head enclose title Three into three table. Whatever you write here, you can see that as the title in web pages. So three by three table, or this is my first web page. Any one title you can give and close the title. After closing the title, close the head section. So title is between the head section, or Head section is followed by the title tag. Now we need the body tag. Body. Suppose if you want to write the background color as red, then B D means background. C O L O R, not C O L O U R. It recognizes the American language. That's why you have to write C O L O R color is equal to red. This is the identification of tag. This is the tag, and this BG color it is the attribute. And whatever you write uh, after this equal sign, that is the value. So this is tag, this is attribute, and this is value. Then after write table border is equal to one, so that we can see the border. For suppose. If you want to draw serial number, name, address, one two A B, Kathmandu, 
Okay. Suppose we have to write the HTML tag to draw this table. 3 into 3, 3 by 3 table. Then first we have to write the row, start the row. That's why this TR, TR is table row. And inside table row, we write here TH. TH means table heading. When you start with the TH tag, then the heading becomes bold and center. So first TH we have to write serial number and in which TH. It means that it makes here one TH for serial number. And then after again TH, what is your name? And slash TH. Now here makes your next row. That is name because within this there is closing of this table row. So for address again we have to write here TH A D D R E S S address. Now here becomes address. We have already written in single row. Now we have to jump in next row or start of next row. That's why we again start TR. We have closed our first row. Now we start of second row. In, inside TR, what we have to write? We have to write here one, that's why TD, table column, one slash TD. In this also we can write td, but when you write td, it comes in normal form. When you write tf, it shows in heading type. That's why it is bold as well as center. That's why for the heading we use ts, and for other table column we use td. And then after next is td a slash td. It means that now here becomes here one. Here A. After that, TD cut for loop. K T H M A N D U cut for loop slash TD. Now you have cut for loop. K A T H M A N D U cut for loop. Cut for loop. And now this row is also finished. So that, let's close that row. After that, now see here, this there, I'll write here. Again, start with next row, TR, and inside TR, TD, inside TD, 2, close TD, now here becomes 2, and then after TD, B, Slash td, now here a draw b, here will be equal, and then after td, ohara, slash td, and ohara, this row also finished, that's why ntr table row, and then after we have to close this table. T A B L E table. Close the table one. After closing the table, close the body one. Close the body one. And then after close, S T M L. When you write this tag in notepad, you can use notepad. When you write this tag in notepad, after that you have to save with file name dot extension html file name any one file name you can write table 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 dot html when you save this format in html dot html you can see the browser there when you open that browser you can see this 3 by 3 table with background red color you can change your background color, blue, green, 
yellow, purple, anyone, or you can give the code of the color with hash sign. You can use that. So HTML start with HTML and end with HTML. And hair section, a title section is enclosed between hair section. So title section is between hair section. These questions comes in exam of PSC operator. So this is important one. And body close with the body. So body busy color red. Body is the tag. Busy color it is the attribute. And this red is the value. Like that table is tag. Border is attribute and one is value. You can write here inverted comma or directly you can write. And T R for table row. And there are three columns as heading, serial number, name and address. So I have written here TS, table heading, serial number, name and address. And only there are three columns. So I close this first row. And again I start the second row and write there three columns. Again I close that row and I start the third row. And in the third row, after that, I in the table here, table here, T A B L E table is closed, and body is closed, and HTML closed, and save that file with file name dot HTML or HTM also you can write. Not HTM also you can write. You can use the extension either HTML or HTM. Okay, I think you have understand how to write. The HTML tag to draw three into three tables. Thanks for watching the video.